So due to bad weather, we've been staying in Kelleberran campsite for three days now. But Jeff, who works here, uh, decided to put us up in the shed. So we just set up our tent, which is great because it means we can stay dry and we're packing up in the dry. So let's continue. Pie time. So I've gone for a Ned Kelly pie. Whatever that means. So we're gonna give this a go. Hmm. Yep. Eggs, bacon, cheese, and beef, which is very strange. It's got um, eggs, bacon, egg, and cheese on top, and then a beef center. Again, it's got quite a doughy crust, which seems to be a running theme of the Australian pie so far. But the flavors are pretty good. It actually works. It looks like they've cracked an egg right in the centre there. Just see the yolk peeking through there. Bit of a grizzly bit. Quite poor quality meat they've got in there, quite grizzly. That's from the Kelleberry Pie Shop and Bakery. Great concerns, but if they'd used slightly better. Pie time. So we had a few days on the road after Kelleber and we did 110 kilometers, which is our furthest day ever to Meriden. Then on to Southern Cross, and then we've just had two days, one at 97 kilometers and one at 90 to get to Coolgardie. So we've stayed here for the night, we're absolutely exhausted. We're just uh, packing up now and then uh, we can head on to Kalgoorlie, which we're gonna stay there for probably two or three days just to heal up before we move on south. We're in Hungry Jack's, also known by the rest of the world as Burger King, in Kalgoorlie, and we are just about to tuck into this feast. Wait, I'm so hungry. So we were going to be leaving today, but it's very windy and stormy. It's been thunder all morning. Maybe we'll have an extra day here before heading to Norseman. So we made a good decision to stay here today because it's been raining a bit more and the wind's picked up as well. It's supposed to get worse this afternoon. So we've taken the time to look around the super pit and the rest of Boulder as well, which is a historic town. So I guess uh, see you in the pit. Just one eye on the fuel light Another on the wheel Then to our next destination Then a hole in my chest Catches me unawares And reminds me just where I'm coming Well, so much for having a rest day Ah, oh, that was a steep hill Worth it for the views though so tomorrow we are going to start our journey through the Nullarbor which means we're going to head basically out of Norseman this direction and then off out into the distance where there's basically nothing. So we've just left Norseman after an extra day staying there, we're a bit set back due to some unforeseen circumstances. That kept us awake most of the night. 
but we've just started our crossing of the Nullarbor. We've got a bit of a tailwind behind us which is good but I think today's a bit hilly. Tomorrow is going to be a lot flatter staying at Fraser's range station tonight. I'm looking forward to tomorrow being flat. There's some nice views. Down through before every exit is a door locked from the inside and I'm dying to find a way out. No one will hear the shouts. <laughs>